Many people are suspicious of same-sex marriages, claiming them to be unproductive social units. Nonetheless, lesbian couples fall in love, get married and bring up children just as any traditional heterosexual couples do. Does it really make sense to hold on to the tradition so obstinately? We no longer choose our partners according to purely biological criteria. What matters nowadays are emotional ties, social and economic position, and lifestyle, probably something more. Women in this list reckon it is a female who is capable of understanding and supporting another female best. These are 10 most famous lesbian women in the world. Let's get going. Ellen DeGeneres and Portia de Rossi DeGeneres initially came to prominence as a stand-up comedian, making numerous appearances on The Tonight Show in the 1980s. Although there was a lot of gossip surrounding DeGeneres' sexual orientation, she didn't come out until her appearance on The Oprah Winfrey Show on April 30th, 1997. The episode sparked controversy and kicked open the closet door for lesbian actresses. In 2003, DeGeneres began hosting a hugely successful daytime talk show. Around that time, she also started dating small screen siren Portia de Rossi, whom she married in 2008 after the overturn of the gay marriage ban in California. Ellen Page Canadian-born actress Ellen Page began her career at a very young age. Her ability to handle complex emotions and dialogue impressed directors, and she continued to build up her resume, consciously avoiding the typical teenage girl roles, which she found to be sexist. In 2005, Page took on the challenging lead role in Hard Candy, a film about a young girl who lures in and traps a man she believes is a sexual predator. The actress, best known for her role in Juno and Inception, came out in an emotional speech to the Human Rights Campaign in February 2014. When asked by E! News why she decided to make the relationship public now, Paige simply said, I'm in love. Walking down the carpet holding my girlfriend's hand is pretty special, she said. It's pretty awesome. Jodie Foster Jodie Foster is an award-winning American actress, best known for her roles in the films Taxi Driver, The Accused, and The Silence of the Lambs. Foster is notoriously private about her personal life. At the 2013 Golden Globes, she declined to give a big coming out speech, saying that she'd already come out to those close to her. In that speech, Foster also expressed gratitude to her former partner, Sidney Bernard, with whom she has two sons. In 2014, at the age of 51, she married her 44-year-old photographer girlfriend, Alexandra Hedison. Fiona Shaw and Saffron Burrows Fiona Shaw is an Irish actress and theatre director, best known for her role as Petunia Dursley in the Harry Potter films. She was in a long relationship with a much younger, stunningly beautiful actress, Saffron Burrows, who interpreted the role of Andromache in the movie Troy and co-starred in The Bank Job with Jason Statham. Shaw and Burrows are reported to have become a couple on the set of the 2002 film The Power Book, an adaptation of the novel by Jeanette Winterson. At the time, Burroughs was living with a film director, Mike Figgis, but left him for a serious, respected, and stern of demeanor Fiona. Cynthia Nixon Famous actress, adored for her portrayal of Miranda Hobbs in the Sex and the City series, came out in 2004 when she announced her relationship with Christine Marinoni. The actress, 46, and education activist, 45, got married in 2012 after eight years of dating. Over a year before the ceremony, Marinoni gave birth to their curly-haired son, Max. The couple has not revealed the details of the child's biological father. Queen Latifah Queen Latifah is an influential American rapper, songwriter, actress, model, and talk show host. Coming from a police family, Queen Latifah witnessed both sides of black urban life in the USA which influenced her rhyming style and life philosophy. Although a famous rapper prefers not to discuss her personal life in public, she was seen involved in romantic relationships with other black women. Queen Latifah insists there have always been gay people in the black community, and claims it to be extremely hard for a black gay woman to come out. Patricia Highsmith Patricia Highsmith was an American novelist known for her psychological thrillers, including the most famous The Talented Mr. Ripley, adapted for screen in 2000, starring Matt Damon and Jude Law. Highsmith's personality remains a mystery, since her contemporaries formed very contradictory opinions about her. Extremely hostile and misanthropic, and totally incapable of any kind of relationship, or 
extremely good company, and very generous. One is known for sure. Patricia Highsmith was in love many times and with many women, but only once did she write openly about lesbianism. This was her second novel, The Price of Salt, adapted into a Todd Haynes film Carol released in November 2015. Rita Mae Brown No one could ever accuse Rita Mae Brown, 71, of having lived a boring life. The best-selling author is nothing if not versatile. Feminist activist, mystery writer, lesbian pioneer, fox hunter, screenwriter, novelist, and animal rescuer. In the 1960s, Brown participated in the anti-war movement, the feminist movement, and the gay liberation movement, for which she was kicked out of university. Brown's coming-of-age lesbian novel, Ruby Fruit Jungle, sold over 70,000 copies. The book's success encouraged her to author more than 50 other novels, many of them touching upon the subject of lesbianism. Martina Navratilova and Yulia Lemigova Born in Czechoslovakia in 1956, Martina Navratilova began playing tennis at a young age, eventually to become one of the top female tennis players in the world in the late 1970s and early 80s. She won every Grand Slam singles title at least twice. Martina Navratilova became the first world-famous pro athlete to come out voluntarily. In 2014, Navratilova proposed to her longtime girlfriend Julia Lemigova at the US Open. 42-year-old Miss USSR 1990 and a tennis legend aged 58 tied the knot in a private ceremony in New York. Samantha Fox Samantha Fox is a popular English singer, glamour model, and actress, who shot to fame with her debut single, Touch Me. The song set the pattern for her career, frothy, sexually suggestive dance pop with good beats and catchy melodies. Throughout her career, Fox always accentuated her sex appeal, making it take priority over her music. Rumors were rife about her sexual orientation, until in 2003, she openly admitted being in love with her manager and fiancé, Myra Stratton. In 2015, she lost her long-term partner aged 60 to cancer. Recently, Sam Fox, already in her 50s, has revealed she's been able to fall in love again as she's gushed about her new girlfriend, Linda Burgett Olsen, 42 and mother of two. Thanks for watching. Please like and share the video in social networks and we'll be right back to you as fast as we can.